Well, look at this. Thrilling, probing, playful. That is how the New York Times describing the play Wolf Play. And next month, you'll have a chance to actually check it out for yourself. Joining me live with all those details, artistic director of ACT Contemporary Theater, John Langs, and director of Wolf Play, Rosa Josie. Good morning to you both. Thank you for being here. Good morning. Good morning. Thanks for having us. You know, the really cool thing about living here in Seattle is we get all this incredible sort of Broadway style theater right here in our own backyard. And that sounds like it's no different with Wolf Play. It's a it's a pretty amazing play, and yeah, it's having an incredible. It had an incredible run in New York, uh -huh. um, and yes, the fact that we can bring this national play here to Seattle is pretty incredible. Can we talk a little bit about and for people at home who might be unfamiliar with it, talk a little bit about Wolf Play and and, and the story. The story of Wolf Play, it's about a young Korean child, a young boy, who is uh, readopted by a couple. The original adoptive family couldn't handle him, mm -hmm. so puts him up for readoption on a Yahoo messaging board. Oh, wow. Yeah, yeah. that's a whole nother play also. Yeah. So the new family that adopts him is a queer couple who have different, uh, are in different places about if this is the right time to adopt a child. Mm -hmm. the one, one of them is really dying to have a child, and the other is about to go pro as a boxer. Oh, wow. So this young boy that's being shunted between these families in this kind of traumatic situation has, um, says he's a wolf and is played by a puppet manipulated by an adult actor. Oh, that's hence, fascinating. Yeah, hence yeah. the name Wolf Play. So the play takes on this sort of traumatic, sort of very dark issues in some ways, but uh -huh. is really a play about family and belonging and who, how, how do we choose our family? Mm -hmm. um, how do we parent a child? Who gets to parent a child? Um, and it's told with a lot of humor. And, and uh, you know, there's puppetry, there's boxing. It's there's a kind of a lightness with the way that Hansel Young treats the material that is kind of magical and wow. it's super moving. That does sound fascinating. And John, I have to ask you. I mean, ever since we got, we kind of came out of the pandemic, and we have seen the return of theater here in Seattle. Uh, what has it been like at Act Theater right now uh, for bringing all these shows here to the area? You know, it's amazing. We actually build all of the shows locally with yeah. local artists and local talent. Yeah, and Rose has been just uh, a director of such high caliber in the community. We're thrilled. We are thrilled to have her. Um, so one of the joys of it is that, you know, we're providing a space for artists to work and to grow right yeah. here locally in Seattle. So while we do um, often look at the national scene for some really decorated and celebrated productions, we're also growing um, a whole, um, you know, group of playwrights here in Seattle. So our mission really is about lifting up Seattle's voice to the national mm -hmm. conversation because we think that we have a lot of thought leaders and um, incredible creative people that need those resources here. I'm glad you mentioned that too because that's true. Like when you're coming to ACT Theater, I've seen so many shows with you guys. I mean, you're, you're, you're talking about local playwrights and local actors and you're giving voice to local artists. I mean, that is major and that really doesn't happen everywhere. Yeah, I think it's it's definitely something we're pivoting towards after the pandemic. And what we did in that time where a lot of the theaters had to go fallow was yeah. we were workshopping and cultivating and developing. So our pipeline right now of new plays by great Seattle playwrights is huge. That's exciting. Yeah, it is. It's very exciting. We're wow. in a good moment. Oh, well, that's really good to hear, especially after the pandemic, because everything's been like either people are doing great or they're struggling. So it's nice to hear that the Act Contemporary Theater is doing well. Yeah, and like Wolf Play, um, we we chose this play because it what I say is it just bangs on all cylinders yeah. theatrically. It is uh, it's a it's comedy. It's it's like um, form breaking in terms of uh, you know the puppetry that's involved and the boxing that's involved. It's visceral, uh, and those are the kinds of plays that really work well. They're they're the things that you can't get sitting in your pajamas at home clicking on Netflix, Absolutely. which we've all gotten very used sure. to, right? And tickets are available right now. They are yes, we're selling them. So right. please act the Org. Go Activator. get your ticket. <laughs> yeah. Well, thank you two for being here. Appreciate it. And of course, break a leg. We can't wait to see the show. Thank you so much.